These legendary boxes display girls with big smiles, showing off their potential. But inside this box, the opposite. I got on probation in 2016. At 13 years old, Diamond McAlphin found herself in the Faulkner County Jail. I got on probation for fighting. I was disrespectful. And I just had no filter. So instead of keeping Diamond there? There was only three girls in there. And it was real quiet until like the boys, they got into it and they were fighting over baby mamas and all that. The judge ordered her across the street to deliver hope and to ultimately become a Girl Scout. I was mad because I mean like, Girl Scouts, ugh. And needless to say, it wasn't what Diamond wanted to do with her time, but <laughs> let's back it up. I was on probation. Put that tag along down and find out why Diamond was ordered there in the first place. I didn't care about how anybody felt and I just liked to see people yell at me because I thought it was just so funny to me. It's how she landed herself on the other side of the law. On my honor. And learned to recite to the Girl Scout law. And my country. country. It's not like the other Girl Scouts. Like the Girl Scouts that be in public. Like I thought we were going to be in public and I was just like, this is so embarrassing. Then I found out it's nothing like the other Girl Scouts. There were no cookies, no badges. You get to sit there and you meet people. You do stuff, you help for the community, but you're also like, you talk about your day, and yeah, talk about your problems. I think what they learned mostly was that they are still girls, and they're not the only girls going through this. They were very supportive to each other. Faye Shepard, the juvenile justice specialist in Arkansas, collaborated with Judge Troy Braswell to start the program Girl Scouts Rise, agreeing that these young girls don't need to be locked up, but rather out in the community working on themselves. Some of the best times for kids are their adult, uh, their adolescent years, but it's also some of the most confusing times. And if they can have a positive experience like they get with the Girls Rise program, we are on the road to rehabilitating them, which is what we want to do. After starting the Girl Scout program, Faulkner County saw an 86% reduction in anger and violence. And the girls graduate from the Scouts saying this. Thank you, Miss Faye. That's usually what they say. But it's a mixture of the Girl Scouts program and the people that made the difference for Diamond. <gasps> Laura! Y'all, sorry, she, she's one she of my, here? she's a life changer. It's about those that really showed they care. They'll sit here and just listen to all your problems and give you advice. Advice and even an invitation to be a bridesmaid in a wedding. It has changed a life. And to those teens that are where Diamond was three years ago. Being on probation is not cute. It's nothing to brag about. And it's the Girl Scouts and a little bit of those cookies that help Diamond get back on the right track. In Faulkner County, I'm Isabella Moeller.